it, do, it does suck when somebody gets a girlfriend and you don't see them for five months, mm -hmm. whether you were li whether you live with me or not. And I and I really do. It, it, it does actually hurt me a little bit inside my soul. Mm -hmm. I'm not so pathetic that I'm going to be like, can you please just like hang out with me once a month? Or like, well, like I don't, I don't know, want to. But the thing is, I, I want to. to. Okay, but I don't want to. I don't want to have to do that. <laughs> like, if you don't do it, then I'm just left here being like, all right. Like, but I'm. I mean, this is me telling you now. Like, yes, I just I miss you. I want to spend time with you, and it is about the house, but it's also not. I mean, I, I you know I, I had every intention to come, you know be there and everything, it just changed. And I'm sorry, I didn't mean to leave you like high and dry like that. Or like make it weird or, mm -hmm. you know, make you feel like I didn't want to be there or anything. I just, I'm planning on meeting somebody that I really, really liked. Life is weird, you know, like you never know what's around the corner. I didn't know a pandemic was gonna hit. You know, and then my whole life changed when, you know, just one date overnight. Like I just love at first sight, you know? I feel kind of torn like between two cities, you know what I mean? I love being with Courtney and I always loved hanging out with Whitney and I hate that like, you know, she's bummed out that I'm not around. I'm bummed out too, but I would be more bummed out if I weren't with Courtney. But unfortunately, I just don't see my situation changing much in the foreseeable future. I don't know, man, things are just too perfect. You know, she's sexy and like beautiful and like the right body type, hilarious. Like she had a cool future lined up for her and I don't know. It's good. It's really, really good. So are you on the way to Marriage Town? Uh, well, wouldn't, you know, who knows about all that. What? Have you already started ring shopping? Because well, you, you ring shop pretty early, typically. Stop. <laughs> Historically, you've ring shopped pretty early. <laughs> Stop. Um, I had something in mind, maybe, you know, like yeah, a little okay. thought, you know. Oh, okay. Would she change her name? She would get rid of her middle name and keep her last in the middle. You know, just so out, you're out of curiosity. So you're discussing what her married name would be, but your is still in my finished <laughs> attic. Get out. What are you doing? You are moving out of me and into her. Jeez. Take your stuff and <laughs> out. Like, okay. I mean, honestly, take your stuff and leave. I can't believe you just said that to me. Well, I did. You just gotta. Okay. All right. And now this doesn't have to be weird. And now you can really intentionally make a plan with me and maybe keep it. Uh -huh. How about that? I feel like Buddy has been so wrapped up in his happiness and his new relationship that he probably hasn't really stopped to think much about me or my feelings or what's going on with you know him living in my home. And so if I'm the one that has to rip the Band-Aid off, I will.